Hey guys, I'm at SHOT Show. Check it out. I'm at the Mesa Tactical booth. I own shotguns. I love shotguns. And if you guys like shotguns, you got to check out what Mesa Tactical has. And I have Zuli, right? Yes. Am I saying that right? Yes. Okay. I am Zuli. I am the marketing manager here at Mesa Tactical. What we have new this year is a LEO telescoping stock system for the Beretta 1301 semi-automatic. What you see here is an aluminum cast CNC machine power corded black adapter which enables you to mount any AR-15 pistol grip or any AR-15 stock system you have laying around. What you see here is a mill spec uh, receiver extension tube. We also have the optional uh, crosshair recoil buffer which includes hydraulic fluid and that absorbs 70% of the recoil felt on a shotgun. So we manufacture all of our products in uh, USA. Okay. We are located in Costa Mesa, California. All of our products include lifetime warranty and no gunsmith is required for you to install. If this system is available for the Mossberg 500 Remington 870 oh, pump action shotguns. Oh, nice. This year we're introducing it for the semi-automatic only because of the recoil system on the Beretta 1301 runs forward to the receiver as opposed to coming back towards the stock. Nice. So we were able to mount a telescoping stock system on the Beretta 1301. Talk about some of the other products you have on yeah. here as well. We also, what you see here is a aluminum shirt shell, shot shell carrier with the integrated Picatinny rail. This mounts through a drill and tap receiver here by those screws. We have this available in four, six, and eight shell versions. And it includes a dual a rubber retention friction there system that holds the shells solidly in place. Last year, at Shot Show 2016, 2015, we introduced a polymer shell carrier version. This is an optional, this is a pretty much another option as opposed to the aluminum. Uh, we created a polymer shell carrier just because it's more lightweight, most, more cost effective. It also has a dual rubber retention system there that solidly holds the shells in place. Now, do these come in different um, capacities as well? This is, this is only available in a six shell version. And oh, okay. it comes with an optional Picatinny rail if you want to mount optics or a red dot. These mount through the trigger pins or uh, like you see there. Or uh, if it comes with the integrated rail, it'll mount through a drill and tap receiver. Do you guys recommend putting Loctite or something on there? Blue Loctite, yeah. that's correct. I know guys are going to ask when they see this video, uh, do you guys have pricing or is it too early for these things? We do have pricing. Uh, it starts at around $36 for the side amount. The ones with the integrated rail go for about $100. Okay. $120. We also introduced the barrel stock adapter for the FN SCAR 16S, 17S. Mm -hmm. This adapter is made of uh, aluminum and it also has a push button capability, ambidextrous. Nice. It allows you to mount any AR-15 style stock onto the FN SCAR. Nice. And how much is that one going to cost if you guys want that? The adapter itself goes for $65. If you want a receiver extension tube, it goes for $110 MSRP. What I have here is a Mossberg 930. I'm going to go ahead and present you the Urbino Tactical Stock. It's a pistol grip fixed stock and uh, it pretty much allows you to mount. It has this link attachment options. It also comes with an optional limb saver butt pad if you want to reduce recoil felt by 40%. We also have another version that comes with an optional adjustable cheek riser if you want to run optics. And uh, yeah, it has a very comfortable rubber center frame grip. And uh, it's two inches shorter than the factory stock, so you can easily just, it's very comfortable and easy to control. And uh, you said it ha you have an option with the cheek riser, is that the one over there? That is Let's go take a look at that one. What you have here is the Urbino with the limb saver butt pad. Nice. It also comes with an adjustable cheek riser. It has a five position rails there. And, uh, you could easily adjust the cheek riser by snapping out the butt pad, sliding it out, and putting it back into whatever cheek weld it is you like. And uh, it comes with the sling attachment options like the hook loop here. It also comes with the sling loop. And uh, you also have an option to mount uh, additional shot shell carriers on the cheek riser. And uh, they come in 4, 6, and 8 shell as well. So, ballpark pricing on these? It starts from 130 to 170 depending on whether you want the optional limb saver butt pad as well as the adjustable cheek riser. Gotcha.